there's so much to see here because there are so many different beaches, so many different places, a lot of restaurants. Uh, I didn't see a lot till now, but uh, definitely uh, I want to see more because there's so much to experience in this island. Just look, if you just look over my shoulder, you see why. Because uh, it's winter time and it's still hot, you enjoy the sun, the people are really nice, they're very warm people, so yeah, I don't enjoy the island, I love this island. I'm the first time here, but I, I already spoke with the director. I want to come, I want to see something because it's a beautiful place. And uh, maybe people don't think, but I love the orchestra. So I would love to see it live. It changed a lot, to be honest, because uh, I'm happy. Before, when I came, I was not really happy. Like, I was happy in my personal life. But uh, since I'm here, I'm happy in my work. And um, there's nothing better in life to be to be happy with, uh, with your work and with your personal life. So Las Palmas, the team, the island changed a lot in my life. Then it was so hot, first of all. And then uh, second of all, because there were so many people. So this was so much affection, was, was beautiful. And the most surprising thing was uh, Valeron <laughs> look, uh, waiting for me at the airport. Was it? No, it was because he's a legend, you know, everybody knows him from TV, I know him from TV. And uh, he was standing there to, to salute me and to welcome me and this was a great gesture from him and from the club. And um, the fun, there was even a funny story, I think I told that already, but it's always funny because he wanted to carry my luggage. And I told him, for me, you're a player like Zidane, Messi, Ronaldo. Impossible, you carry my luggage. I will carry my luggage, uh, I will carry my luggage along. I never played here. I think it's a great experience. I played in the three biggest, now in the four uh, biggest leagues in Europe. And it's a, it's a new challenge, you know, it's a new stadiums, a new fans new things to achieve, so that's why it was no question when I had the, the offer to come here to, to play in La Liga. All play football, every team, you know, every team try to play football. They're like two, three teams, they're similar maybe to England, they maybe play more longer balls, but the rest of the teams, they all want to play football. It's very technical and that's, uh, that's very different to all the other leagues. And um, I like it because I never had it in my career, but I, I love it. Como se disfruto. Un el clásico. Yeah, because it's the greatest game on, on the planet. I think it's even bigger than a Champions League final or World Cup final because it's just like two teams with the best players uh, in the world on one field, you know? It's just 22 superstars. I think that's the biggest game what a player can play. I think Ronaldo is a great player and a great professional. And um, I think he's a big example for all the other football players who are not big on a high level because he has the, like, he breathes football and he lives football every day. And that's not just what you hear, that's what people know, because 24 hours he just lives for this job. And uh, this, this, uh, this, this is what I admire, that a person has this like, sacrifice, he leaves this sacrifice to, to do this job for 15 years and then after it's done, but in these 15 years, he never comes home and says, today I didn't give everything. And that's, that's like an idol, it should be an idol for every sportsman on the planet. We have a good relationship because we respect each other, and that's the most important. Because um, because he, he's a young coach, or is the, like um, not since long in the first league, but uh, he has a lot of like he's a perfectionist. He loves the perfection. Even if we play good and we win a game, he always tried to find the things where we didn't do good, and that's very good because we're a young team and people has to have to improve every day, and that's a good thing. And I like it. And he gives me a little bit of space on the field. He, he tells me like, this is your role, this is your situation, this is what you have to do. And after this, if you all do that, you, you're free to play. And I, and I like that, that he gives me that space. Uh, I never had the movements, the, the movements I do now, because uh, we play a lot of tiki-taka. So there are different movements. We don't go so much in the space. Maybe we come more to the ball. And this is what he, what he tried to explain to me, when to come through the ball and when to use the little bit of space. And this is what he tried to give me. And I think, I think we're doing quite good in that. My personal best goal was, I think, against Valencia. The way I had the ball, I think, was my personal, but from the team, 
was the goal against Villa, Villarreal, of course, because we had the perfect uh, build-up and the finish was perfect. So there were like two very, very nice goals. If I say favorite, I would take the one from Villarreal because there are many players involved. No, I don't think about the future. I just think about finishing this interview, going home. That's, <laughs> that's my future. I don't know what's going to happen. You know, I love to play here and I'm happy here. What the future brings, we will see. The main objective is to win the next game. And at the end of the season, we will see where we are. Because if I say we want to play in Europa and then we don't come to Europa, it's just, it's not right. We just have to think from game to game.